Granny used to tell me all the time Sparks and fits and preparation combined The road been right here all this time But you gotta look with more than your eyes And the small axe Jesse Rod representing for I just star mindset Rich forever Uh, being the president of um, the Naya being guitar for Syria. Well, as the record keeper, I was basically a liaison between him and the Aishan. Even the Bingi at times. You see? So, I was there. You know, it wasn't exactly my influence. It was the influence at the time in Jamaica. Actually, it was coming through the, the indigenous movement. You see? See? Where, where Sizzler visited. Twenty ten, and he was crowned there in twenty ten. After visiting Mugabe, we did a um, request of him with a letter asking Mugabe to spearhead this re- re- this redemption of going back to Africa, repatriation. That was one of his mandate to to Zimbabwe, twenty ten. And, he, and when he was in Ghana, they crowned him as the first crown for the Toronto people, you know, which is an intricate part of the Akan people, who are basically the Maroons in Jamaica as well. So, Sizzler was so from. Him, right, in Ghana, mm-hmm. as the first prince of the Toronto tribe which is the Akan people, which was done in a sense to connect the Akan people in Jamaica, which is the Maroons, to the Ghana. They are Khan because people. this was to be done this was to be done from nineteen ninety two mm. when Michael it was because of international pressure why Michael Manley had to give up that seat to the, what was termed the Crown Prince, P.J. Patterson. The Crown Prince is the terms of the sovereignty of the Berlin stance, you see? And that's when Ryans came to Jamaica to see if, if Patterson was ready to really twin these twin, as you heard, Ghana is the, <clears throat> the gateway to the, of, of return. This could have only be done through the sovereign state of the Maroons in Jamaica with Guyana from 92. So that did not happen because Brother P.J. Patterson wasn't dealing with the sovereignty of the... <clears throat> you see, so this is when Rollins flew back, and that's when the, the Ghana and that kind of a relationship kind of broke down because Jamaica is being capitalized or capsized by colonial rule in all kinds of ways. This is the same reason why His Majesty had told them, 61, that they should send the right people. We could not send the Queen's government to organize with a sovereign government of His Majesty. His Majesty wanted to see the only other people that defeated the British army as, his, as he had done. All right. His Majesty could have set up a sovereign, a so, His Majesty could have organized this is why even in 2015 we still see where in order for the NU 
to even um, function. It has to first structure its headquarters in Jamaica and sovereign under sovereignty of the Maroon. So that's why the six region headquarters was established up at a compound 2015. So these are, 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 are protocols of sovereignty that must that we're not aware of. So when we come now because of Sizzler's recognition from the Ghana kings to connect in Jamaica and connect back that sovereign rights. It was more a, a joke thing or a pinky thing or a bubble thing, you know, for people to fly down. You know, maybe himself not understanding the fullness of what the indigenous president is for. He was for. You know, and, and he did not do the thing in the right way. So it looks like it's a joke. All right. Um, Let me see. There's, there's, there's a, a pretty, there's a lot of um, things which is fling out the more while people say a lot of things. I remember um, a few months ago during um, the whole situation um, about the seal and thing. Uh, people, one were saying that and and i can you know i can show you comments even on on this platform here where you know people are said why is bad man thing since i used to become a president and take with the seal and all these type of things but in terms in terms of the the, the, the presidency is in um because we just want to clear up clear up this type of mysticism that is that is out there and, and people might view the virgin in a wrong in a wrong light. You know what I mean? Oh 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 truth is that is 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 bad man thing that says that you used to become any presidency. A uh, president of the Naya being Cause we hear these talks all the time. You know, people can always start those talks, but you know, those are just part of life, I guess, because they even said that about him at double era. And you know, as a matter of um, the tear they had, the Royal Judah Coptic stamp, he's got the, the, um, the Maroon community. One of them stamp on here, and he's got. Um, I think he's got the better seal at one point, and also the better thing is seal, because our intent was to have one administration, one one administration that is an all mansion consists of everyone. Mm-hmm. So if the if the Maroon is agreeing, the Bubba in agreeance, some may not be agreed that the Crown Prince of the Bubba Shanti establishment was who was working with Caesar. You know. So all those other priests who might have their own different thing that Aina has not really mindful of, you know what they want to think or what they want to say, but they shouldn't say that it was any kind of bad manism or any. All these things that they say about even a fire that was up there, these things are propaganda by evilous intentions. You know, and we shouldn't really cater for those things. Now, the, the, as for the uh, stamp on the seal of the Mahabin Order. You know, this, I don't have to go into the details of it, but I can tell you this much, that no Mayabingi priest has ever had that stamp and seal until I took it to them, 2003, you see. 
and many of them was not even aware that that stumpancy was taken to Sizzla from 2003 for safekeeping. And one of the reasons why the stump and seal had to be secure was because it had stump a letter authorizing um, Jimmy Tucker, a Jesuit priest, as the executive chairman of the Nyabingi Order. And it had stumped another letter authorizing um, ones to be suing the Queen in a way that was, you know, real ignorant. So, so, the so, stamp was so, doing some um, things that it was not supposed to. Yes, I mean, so all right, during them period, who had the seal that time? When 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 those unauthorized letters... Okay, the, the, uh, the stamp, yeah, that was when Bingy Irons, who was the one who created the seal, in a sense, because the design of it was officially from the new Bingy, but the material manifestation of it was through Bingy Irons in the 80s with the help of the Bridgens in America who created that seal and Irons brought it back to Jamaica and it's been in his position since. And these many things that he used to have that stamp by having even the priest then with it, you know, it was, it was getting kind of dangerous. And the last one was 2005, when his signature and another two Irishian signature was on a letter authorizing Jesuit priest Jimmy Tucker as, you know, executive chairman of the Nairbingi Order to go and do things with, you know, so up until that point, that's when, you know, The stamp and seal had to be secured. Since I was the secretary, a stamp and seal is what is belongs to the office of the secretary. You see, under the priest. So when I, I um, during the global reason in 2003, I secured that stamp and seal from um, Brother Miguel's own because I was using it to, even from 2001, when that letter was written to the Queen, you know, that's when I first had the stamp for a period of time to get that letter sorted out. So it, the stamp and seal was more, to me, as director of record, was my responsibility to secure. And that's why I even initiated taking it from the one who created it and, and had it at his home and bring it to Scott's Pass, you see? So, and, 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 let me ask the audience, hmm? at, what, what, at what point can a president per se have the seal to use? When he... No, 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 you see, hmm. the stamp and seal now is affixed to the signature of the treasurer, the priest and the elect of record, those were the three people who was responsible for the stamp and seal. Okay. So you might not have known that Caesar was the treasurer of the Nia from 2003. So between him, myself, and the priest, the stamp is in the right portfolio. It's not okay. supposed to be anywhere else. Okay. Until you can say since there is no more the treasurer and there is a new treasurer and you know but and and when the elders did come to a resolution that he would secure the stamp and seal until the office was made and then we'll have a a, a safe with a lock and key that the the this that can be monitored in there right you see <clears throat> but just to say that I could never regret, because as bad as things is, I don't, since that is not going to be used in the stamp, because the stamp cannot be used without, without the signature of the priest and the, the elect of record, mm -hmm. as well as the treasurer. But since that stamp has been secure, I am, I am very much 
um, have nothing to regret from placing that such stamp with the authority of the elders under the care of Caesar. You see, because since then, what this, they have created another stamp in Jamaica for the Bingy House. And what they have used it to do since is still criminally needs to be investigated and serious charges can be laid for when one put the rest of our community consent to documents with government in Jamaica that is not profitable to the community. You know, those things are, are dangerous and that's what we don't want uh, our stamp and seal to be involved in anything that is treacherous in any way to so, us, the, the family. So why do you think ones are not following that order? Is it because ones do not see Caesar then as, as, as someone to be the president? Because we have to look at the reality now, you know. And I'm just going, may I ask you these things by even what I see people commend on. You know, because people saw Caesar as this, this, this bubble youth and him, 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 is, him is bubble and him is from outer Bobo Elan, you know, so all this Bobo now come and, and, and want to be um, heading the, 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 the Naya Bingi House as, as president. You know, those are the type of things me hear people say, me see people type these things, people ask me these questions and things. Is it, is it because of that why people are not, uh, ones are not following the order and then would want to have a second seal? Yeah, well, what people say again, you know, as a, as a advocate and an activist of righteousness and truth and right, it is up to search to set the record straight and not listen to everything that because you would be confusing even yourself and myself if i explain to you what our the administration intent was putting in place as terms an indigenous president and i can always validate that because i personally was the one who drafted the document and I, that validates Sizzler as the indigenous president to speak on her voice on behalf of the rest of community so that he could, we could solidify the voice of the Maroons, the communal and revivalists as one indigenous voice. Not what he thinks, not what he says, but what is the right thing that the collective council decide and mandate him to do as, as such. And, and the, the collective people. So if I tell you this and you keep and you come back now and you says people says, oh, could Susan be Bobo and um, Bingy? These things are deliberately spread to create confusion, to defeat the, the purpose right. of, of what the true purpose exactly, is. Exactly, for. exactly. And that is that is why you now the eye is, is, is clarifying these things so people can have a better understanding and don't run with that confusion. You see, at the confusion, I try to clear up, you know, so people understand that that is not the case. You know what I mean? So the rumors that spread out there, the false narrative that push out there about the Virgin and, and, and the old presidency and the seal, that needs to clear up. So that we are clear up now. Give thanks. See, because the eye is the, I, the better one to give a clearance on all of this thing, you know, because the eye is elect of records. See, the eye of the eye signature, anything to do with the seal, it's not just Miguel Collins or the priest. It needs the third signature for it to be authorized. Isn't that so, my lord? Mm-hmm. Right, that is perfect. Right, so the eye is the perfect person. To, to clear up all of this mysticism, my lord. 
Yes, uh, good thanks for that, you know, because that is, you asked the question earlier, why wouldn't they want to cooperate with the original seal? Because I, for one, as the elect of record with the priests, uh, come to the consent with the elders that any document going out that this stamp and seal is going to be affixed to has to be read by myself and presented to the elders as well. Simple. In transparency, you see? So people want to go around and sign write letters and and stamp it around the corner for all kind of personal different. It will not work in this government, you see? Or to sell out the rights of the people. So because they don't want to deal with the thing collective, transparent, then they find reason to go and create a different seal and check the history of that seal because time to come you will see what that new seal they created have done since about 2013 or so since uh, uh, in terms of ganja industry and selling out the ganja rights and unifying with advisory council that led by homosexual kind of Rasta, so-called Rasta de Muro, and, 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 and all these different engagement with um, youth and culture, sponsoring everything going on, you know. All of these things that, that has been mis working against the community is coming under those kind of scrupulous administration that can it and I want I want this one thing to be clear but you know because apart from the ones who who don't want to work transparently, they may have various different reasons. Some of them are directly employed by the government, colonial government, Queen's government. I'm Jamaica. For example, our beloved um, legal counsel that we um, facilitated with certain amount of knowledge and direction that he would go gone to college in the early and study the indigenous rights and how to secure our rights. His name is Marcus Gough. You know, he went, he did his training. He was among us. You know, we trained him. And, and uh, as a team within the Millennium Council, you know, how to secure uh, the intellectual property rights of the community, you know. And after I personally sent those documents to the bridge in when he was. I guess that the mindset. Smash that subscribe button. See you on the next video. I guess that the mindset.